Good morning and g'day paddles and welcome back to the garden with me, Swinal I like. How are you guys doing today? I am doing really well because my brother has helped me get us back into a car, which I can't even tell you is such a huge relief. Oh, so on our calendar we see that there's nothing happening, as you saw there. <laughs> um, so this is the last episode that I don't have any audio for, so... We'll be back to normal scheduled program starting tomorrow. <laughs> um, I'm a little bit out of whack with the whole timetable too. Well, I know a couple of recipes. I thought I'd find, send you some. Maybe it'll help you more. Mine more ore or something. Algae soup. Oh, that's just gross. I think I actually go and make this here in a second. <laughs> yeah, I do. Because it, it was slimy, right? I mean, you. Who wants to eat algae soup? <laughs> But yes, it is a huge relief um, having wheels again, <laughs> um, and it's a very nice car. I'm quite happy with it. If you follow me on Twitter, you would have seen I posted about it. So that makes me, it makes life so very much easier. Easier. I can't. It's so much easier. So much easier. Oh, so it's a huge relief and a huge burden, and we're back in action, and it's good. It's very good. So yay! <laughs> what are you about, you guys? What are you up to? What have you been doing? I know it's been a like it's been a weird couple of weeks, and it usually is around this time of year, simply because you know people are on holidays or they're you know they're away or they just want to spend time with family and things like that. So you know routine and stuff tends to sort of slip by the wayside. Even though I said that I would do my very best, level best, to uh, stick to a schedule, I'm not doing as well as I'd hoped I would be. <laughs> but um, that's because we've got nephews over and visiting family, and it tends to eat into your, your free time, <laughs> recording time, so, but that's okay. It's always good spending time with family, because oh, you never know when they're not going to be here, right? Right? Right. Uh, let's see what we're doing here. I've, I, so it's the 27th of, of, of some of, no it's not, it's the 27th of winter. I will get my words right here in a second, but um, we're nearly at the end of we're nearly at the end of winter, and I'm really glad that I didn't, you know, just keep recording a whole bunch of them so that I, I couldn't actually, you know, bring it back into spring of year two. <laughs> so I'll be able to do that properly this now, so yay. This is our rare crow that we got. Look at it. It looks like a raccoon. I think it's actually super cute. I've never gotten that one before, which is really cool. So that's an exciting little bit of thing. Our trees will start growing, and... We've got a lot of gold there. We've got a lot of gold there, so we can actually start, you know, planning on upgrading the rest of our tools. We need to get the axe and the, you know, all sorts of things, so. Milk in the cows, as we do. But anyway, I hope you guys haven't minded listening to my voiceovers. It's been harder to do. Um, coming up with things to talk about. <laughs> Short of, you know, the thoughts you have when you play the game, you know. It's, it's, you've got to sort of rethink, what was I thinking when I did this? What was I going to do when I did this? But that's okay. I think we're doing all right. We need to get a goat. Now that I'm looking at that, we definitely need to look at getting a goat. I think I can afford it now, actually. I have to look at that, but we're going to try and get as many seeds and as much, um, oh, see, there's Robin. She's, she's upgrading our coop. Yay, which means we can get ducks soon. So we've got to have money for that as well. So awesome sauce. Um, I want to try and um, get some of the bundles done too. We're running a bit behind, I think. But that's okay. Well, what have you been up to? How has your new year been so far? Did you make any resolutions? Um, I'm not a big one for making actual resolutions. I just sort of, because, you know, you can make different choices and different decisions every single day, and it's not all down to that one day. You can have goal in mind, and we should always have goals in mind, something to work toward and aim for, right? So I don't really make resolutions in that regards, <laughs> which is probably why I'm not really too upset about not particularly keeping to my new schedule. <laughs> Never mind. Oh well. Um, but I am starting to look into uh, streaming here on YouTube. Um, playing some games that we can stream across here, possibly different to the seasons that I have, which would be a better idea anyway. And I've got to get in and record the new series, Sky Factory 3 series, which is quite exciting. 
I have a server, server that I can play on for that one. What are we doing here? Oh, this is the copper thing. That was the picking... Okay, that's what that was. That was picking up all the pieces of copper, and it totally worked, the idea about if you take the one piece at a time out of the chest, you can complete that quest with Clint. I'm not sure why he thinks there's going to be special gems with copper, but hey-ho, there you go. <laughs> 320 gold. All right. So that's that's what that is. But, um... Yes, we've got some new recordings. I want to try and get some collabs happening too. Maybe a new one with Samphoria. It's always fun to play with Samphoria. We always have good, lots of laughs and a lot of fun that way. So here we're going to be doing some fishing. Ah, yes. Looking at all the bundles. A lot of these I can't get because we're out of season. So we just have to slowly work on it. We can get the sturgeon. And I'm pretty sure that's what I'm heading north for now. Because the best spot that I, for, according to the wiki, the best spot to find the sturgeon is up at the lake section, which is right at the top, um, over by the mine. Um, and let me just, I'm going to pull out the fish thing so we can have a look at this real quick. It looks a little jumpy on my screen. I hope it's okay for you guys. I apologize if it's not. All right, so fish... Uh, let's see, sturgeon, scrolling down, scrolling down, sturgeon. Here we go, this is the spot, yeah, this is the spot. Lake outside the mines, so yeah, this is the best spot. And according to the wiki, it also says to stand right here at the end and try and get it from here. So, any luck? I mean, of course I know what's going to happen, but I'm just playing along, right? <laughs> get it? Playing along? Never mind. Anyway, what we get? Bullhead! Meh! We get a lot of those actually. So there's a lot of um a lot of fish that we've never even seen. I don't even know where to get half of these, man. There's a lot of fish in this game. Scorpion carp? Huh. Dorado, and of course we got the albacore, which was very exciting. I did <gasps> treasure chest! You always gonna catch the fish. We're not gonna catch the fish. No way. Way too bouncy. I can't wait until our fishing proficiency is bigger. Whoa, that was fast. Let's go. Um, what else is there? Ling cod. I think that's one we have to we have to get for a bundle. River, town, and forest lake outside the mines. Ah, so that's a spot for that as well. What else can we get up here? Um, there is a there is a there's a table in here that goes through. Where could that be? Um, is it in the bundles? in the bundle page. I found a page and I've lost it. Um, but I will link it to the link in the description because this wiki is like a no end of help. There's even secret little things here that... Oh, there's, they went that one. Secret um, things in here that apparently... Um, oh, not Chucklefish. What's his name? What's the dude that made the game? Oh my gosh. Uh, Concerned Ape. That's his name. There we go, guys. We got treasure and we... Get the fish. Get the fish. Yes. Uh, Concerned Apers have even mentioned that nobody's actually found yet, so there's some secrets that are out there that we don't even know about. <laughs> and he's, he's staying, he's staying mum on. Oh, but I tell you what, you know what I'm looking forward to? I am seriously looking forward to co-op. That is going to be amazing. Multiplayer, I mean, seriously, multiplayer Stardew. I mean, that is going to be amazing. And hopefully in the next update, which would just be so cool because we could play with all our friends. That'd be amazing. I mean, I'm not sure how how it would work, or, or you know, do you also have the one house, or do you have multiple houses? Is it going to be a new map? I don't even know. I'm not sure how it's going to be hosted or anything like that. But I think co-op is going to be a lot of fun. Because I mean, it's fun playing by yourself. I mean, I love the game. What's this? There it is. There's our sturgeon. Woot! <laughs> Let me make a run for it. <laughs> So we've been looking, we've been wanting to get that for a while. But yeah, I'm not sure how, I'm really not sure how it's going to run, but I think it'll be amazing actually playing with people that you can properly interact with. Maybe they should have a map where you could have like different farms or something, you know, they could actually travel to other people's farms or something. That would be cool. That would be cool. If you could visit other people's farms, that would be so cool. Wrong bundle. 
Not that one, not that one, that one! Here we go, here we go, ready, sturgeon! Bam, done! Oh yeah, bundle complete! Dun dun dun! What do we get? <laughs> A dress spinner. I'm pretty sure we already have that, but hey, we can't put it on there anyway. I think it takes off your bait. I think that's how it works. There's a lot of fish things that we haven't done, but I'm thinking... Right now, I'm watching him. How cute is he? I did a crochet one! <gasps> I did crochet one! It's the cutest thing! Crochet Junimo! I might even stick a little photo right here. See? Cute as pie! Cute as Junimo! Oh yes, I got some vaults because we, we have enough. So, and we have a little bit of time to um, gain some more gold. So, may as well start knocking those out as well. The other ones are sort of a little bit more, not end game, but when we're getting like <clears throat> lots of wines or iridium quality things or, you know, that sort of stuff. So, that is all good. We've made a start on that. We've got the bundle done. It's very exciting. So, we're just going to go through the chest here, which is what I did, because we needed to recoup some of that money pretty quickly. So, we're getting rid of a lot of this stuff. We don't need to keep a whole lot of it. So, money is better. <laughs> so, selling a whole whack of gems and fun things, which is always helpful. I mean, you, you could store all them up, but you don't necessarily need them all either. And the rate we're going, especially with the refined quartz there in the recycle bins... <laughs> We get a lot of quartz. There's a lot of glasses. A lot of blind people walking around not being able to find their glasses. <laughs> but what about you? Are you looking forward to the co-op um, mode of the game? I think it's going to be a lot of fun. It's going to open up whole new avenues within the game. So, very exciting. I'm not sure when it's due either, but hopefully it won't be too long. So if we sell these here, we should make quite a bit of cash. And I think it's time to sleep. And it's only a short one today, because I want I wanted to get back into playing the game. Ancient Sword, we've got to remember that, to take that and, um... Oh, <laughs> I sold the algae soup. <laughs> well, why not? I mean, it's algae soup after all. Who'd want to eat it? <laughs> Alright, sleep time. Bit of a babble day, but you know what? That's okay. We'll be back into the game proper as of, you know, the next episode. So that we can actually... Look, I do have two. Dress spinner, dress spinner. Oh, well, never mind. What, was I going to try and sell it? I have no idea. That's okay. I guess I do. Really? No. I have no idea what I'm doing at this point. <laughs> ah, that's what I was doing. Okay. At any rate, it's been interesting doing this. I hope I never have to mess up again. <laughs> You know what? That's bound to happen. I've messed up plenty of times. I think we all do anyway, right? It's how we recuperate in the first place. Alright, sleeping. Let's see what we earned for the day. Ooh, level 9 foraging. Axe proficiency. And the rain totem. Cool. That actually makes it rain. Like, you can make that rain. You put that down and you make it rain. Which is really good when you're ready to get married. And you want to force the old miser dude down at the beach to come. Um, so we made 6,616. That's almost got our money back. Um, if you have enjoyed today's episode, please don't forget to play on the like on the like button. Comment down below and subscribe to become a pedal. I hope you have a wonderfully bloomy day and I will see you next time. Until then, this is Silent Lilac, signing off. Bye!